In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this type of AI avatar talking animation that I'm going to use personally in my channel. Not like other YouTubers who just tell you that they don't use that method to make their AI avatars. It's all going to be free and easy to make. So, let's start. Step 1. To generate an image, there are penalty options out there. Pixlr, Pixart, Canva, CapCut, Lexica, and many more. I actually tried every single AI, but no one gave me a satisfying result. So, I will show you guys a super easy way to make perfect looking AI avatar. Let me show you how. First, create a new account on Leonardo. Paste the same prompt and just edit and add a black mask. Select Albedo XL. For alchemy, choose anime. Select 16.9 aspect ratio, then generate. As you can see, these images came out really well, but none of them are straightforward. You can get that with many tries, edit prompt and try, but if you want an easy and fast method, then try image to image, click here, turn on image input, and take a screenshot of your ideal avatar from anywhere, or go to YouTube and search Smart Hustler. Then open this video and take a screenshot. Now upload that image to here, then hit generate, wait a few seconds, and there you are. And I'm absolutely surprised with the quality. I don't think we can generate this type of high quality image with free tools. I'm downloading this one. Editing image. Upload this image to PhotoP. And as you can see, the background is black. It is happen. Because we upload this image in image to image input. So it is very easy to remove that. Just select the magic wand tool and click on the black spot. Then press delete. For this area, zoom in by pressing the Alt plus scroll key in the mouse, then press the H key to drag and adjust the position, then select magnetic lasso, and just draw the line. It will automatically select the area. Then join the line and press delete. Now adjust the position to the face. Click Magnetic Lasso. Select the entire mask except the border. It depends on you. I like the border to be there. Now select a brush tool and choose your preferred color from here and paint on the entire mask. The black mask is looking good, but it's your choice. You're probably thinking why we need to do this. Well, the answer you will get shortly. I don't know why, but I go for a grayish kind of color. Can you tell me in the comment which color is more preferable that I can use in my avatar? No matter what color you choose, you need to make it more realistic. To do that, select the smudge tool, drag the end of the mask area to the center from each side, and drag one time from the top of the mask. Now you can see the difference. Now click on the raster mask from the bottom right corner, and then export the image. First click on file, then click on export as, then choose PNG and save it. Then click on any blank area, and press Ctrl plus Z to undo. And we got the whole image back. Again, follow the same steps and export the whole image. Here's the second step, finding a background for your AI avatar. Listen, you can stick with the same background, but you are not watching a regular tutorial. If you watch me, then you will create or make something above average. The choice is yours. By the way, it's all about the result, and that is God level. Go to Lexica AI. I searched every single prompt so you don't have to. Just search for nighttime room view and pick one from here that is suitable for our studio. I think this one is quite good. Or you can search exactly this prompt if you want to get this type of image. Also, you can explore this type of image style by clicking here. After seeing many images, I think it's better to stick with the first one. After all, first love is something you want to forget, but you can't. So download any image that you like to use as your setup or studio. By the way, we have completed this step. Next, finding background. Now, go to YouTube and search for nighttime ambient city views. You can try any other search term that you want to put in your background. I found this one, and it's okay. Copy the link and go to Streamable because it's 42 minutes long. Paste the link. Trim the video, and click on Create Video. Click on the three dots, click the download link, and then download. Now open CapCut and import all the files, then drag this video to the timeline. Next drag the avatar, adjust it like this. Now drag the mask onto the timeline and set it in the image like this. Now use the mask to crop the mask image. Just carefully note what I am doing. After setting up everything, use the keyframe and press the right arrow key 10 times. Then slide down the mask a little bit using Y axis key to make it minus 15.
Again, press the right arrow key 10 times and reset the mask position to where it was. Just select this number and type 0. Again, follow the same step, move forward 10 times, then select the Y axis and type minus 15. Repeat it for the entire 10 seconds or 15 seconds, or just cut it after repeating it for 5 to 6 times, and make sure while you're cutting your video, it should be cut from the place where a keyframe is showing the mask down, then press arrow key 10 times, and then cut your video otherwise it will not look perfect. And then copy and paste it side by side. Now export this. This is the ultimate outcome. If you find it the most helpful and 100% original guide on how to make an AI avatar, then subscribe.